Hey guys, what's going on? It's Graham Tyler here today to talk about a movie that I've seen that unfortunately uh, Tyler has not seen, but that's okay. Well, that's fine. And it is called Bigger. Bigger the movie. Bigger um, with our boy Callum. With Callum Von Moger as Arnold Schwarzenegger. And uh, so with Steve Cook. No, Steve Cook's not in it. Oh, he's not. Mm -hmm. I I had the unfortunate pleasure to uh, <laughs> to watch this wretched movie. Well, it's on Netflix. It is not on Netflix. It is not. But it's on YouTube. Oh, it is on YouTube. There is a, there is somebody that put it on YouTube. Okay, watch it. I went ahead and watched it, and I tell you what, it is a horrible movie. And I am very sad to hear that because Callum is my boy. I like him. I like his. I like his style. And I am very sad to hear that, I, if I, you will. I went ahead and watched it because of the fact that it was just like, you know what, I mean, like, Callum's in it, in which... It's got some big, I mean, it's got a big name like Callum in it, and you well, love to see just, it's the history, right? Julianne Huff's also in it, and, and we, yeah, yeah, so, so, so it's, so to give you guys a little bit more context, it's the history of how Joe Wider became Joe Wider, right? And, and, uh, which, honestly, I felt like the movie was very rushed, um... And on top of that, they put a lot of plot lines that did not make any sense in it. Yeah, just was, to, was it kind of all over the place? It was all over the place. And yeah. then on top of that, they were skipping to years of just like randomness. It was just like, I, I didn't make any sense. Yeah. Um, and then the, the whole thing is like, it's like you start, you start at the beginning of Joe um, and his brother. Joey. He's, he, he's at his brother's funeral, right? So, so like he's just sitting there and then somebody like a reporter is just like, uh, he's like, every single time I've been trying to talk to you, you seem that you just want to think about working out and eating and everything else, but now you're actually wanting to do some work. And he's like, it's because my brother is dead. And then he's just like, well, he's like, let's talk about that. And then he's like, well, I can't talk about his story until I talk about mine. And then he goes into his yeah. own story. And then from there, it's just, it's completely just... It's so selfish. Ugh. Yeah. It's just, it's wretched. It's absolutely like, there is some things that you, Vanessa, or what's your name? Vanessa um, Hutchins? No, not Vanessa Hutchins. Victoria Justice is in it. Really? Yeah, Victoria Justice is in it. Well, look at that. And her little Victorious. scene. Yeah, her, she, she's probably in it for like, like, she, overall like within like you see her to not seeing her within like 20 minutes if that really way. I mean it's super small but I mean actually I would give it closer to like 15 okay but 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 the thing is it's just it doesn't like her part doesn't make any sense right he he marries like Joe Wider marries this girl and then falls in love with Who's her played by Vanessa yeah then really? then splits with her then he finds this other model and pretty much like falls in love with her then like tries to marry her but then like he's still married back to this girl and it's, it's just like it's this really complicated type of thing yeah. and like the, the, it's overacted it is absolutely just like the music's trash it's cliche. Not even a good soundtrack. Not even a good soundtrack. It's Come on. Just, I mean, I appreciate them talking about Joe Wider, right? It's like he's the untold story of bodybuilding. Sure. Like how it came. You just to wish be. it was done a little bit better. Oh, absolutely. I think I will like his story on how he came to be was. It's very fascinating to where he actually did lifting, and then on top of that, he loved he loved the physique. Right, he wanted to yeah. see the perfect. He liked the aesthetic version of yeah. it. Yeah, yeah, and so and so then he started training Arnold, and it seemed like he was his personal trainer. But I, I want to say at one point he wasn't, you really? know. And okay. so it just it just didn't it just didn't make any sense. And like Callum being Arnold, it was like okay, you can definitely tell that he didn't have any sort of acting chops to begin with. I want to compete in Mr. Olympia. When you train with me, you will win Mr. Olympia. I want to win Mr. Olympia. Only once. Huh. Man, it was, it was some, rough. It was, it was put rough. together really bad. It was just rough. Yeah, it was. It was absolutely rough. I actually had to skip some parts because I was just <laughs> like, this was. It didn't make any sense. Yeah, it didn't. It did it hold your attention at least. At no, all? it didn't. Yeah. it didn't at all. I was like, I'm going to like watch, watch, watch this just while watching it, and still, yeah. I still was like, whoa. Yeah. It was. Ugh. But anyway, um, I looked it up. It has a twenty percent on Rotten Tomatoes. If that tells you anything. That says anything. 6.4 out of 10. Okay. Now on IMDb? Uh, on, on, on IMDb. IMDb is a little bit more generous. Okay, I was going to say, Ron, like what, what one do you prefer? Because anytime Rotten I look... Tomatoes. Really? Oh, that's the move? 100%. Yeah, that's the move. 
you'd rather go Rotten Tomatoes than IMDb. IMDb is like generous for a lot of movies. Is it? Yeah. Okay. That's fair. But anyway, um, so I thought I just wanted to talk to you about it just because of like, yeah. I mean, it's Callum, right? Our boy Callum. I and mean, it's his first acting gig. First acting gig, and this is prior to the injuries. Prior to the injuries. Um, and it was made in 2018. I mean, did he look, I mean, good. obviously like when I first saw him, he looked good. I was going to say he looked good in the movie. He, you could tell it was he a good, good, it was a good portrayal of Arnold anyway. Uh, well, I mean, the whole it's going to be hard to find somebody who looks like Arnold with that build. You know what I mean? I was going to say the big chest. That's the problem. That's probably, the problem. He was probably like trying to hit chest like every day for like so, two months. So it's like, like his, his, his shoulders were a lot more round compared to Arnold's. Um, and yeah. Arnold, Arnold, I mean, and plus, Say what you want, dude. Arnold did not have huge shoulders. But the separation of the bicep compared oh, forget to it. his tricep. Oh, forget it. That was what Arnold... One of the best made. biceps and chest. Yeah. Absolutely. I mean, like, hands down. Right? Even now. Oh, absolutely. I mean, like, his, his, his chest and bicep were absolutely amazing. Yep. So it's kind of hard to display that. I mean, like, Callum... The square jaw and everything else looks like him, right? But honestly, if they could have, they should have put like some sort of wig on him, even to make him look a little bit more like more of Arnold having With the, the hair, hair, right? Yeah. Didn't have any hair, and it's just like it looks very off. Yeah. He was, ugh, ugh. One more. Oh. One more. Last one. Ah. That's what it sounded like. I'm like. <laughs> You're yeah, literally forcing yeah. it. Yeah, seriously. Yeah. You force it out. And I'm just like sitting there, I'm like, this, and the acting was just over overacted. There's a, yeah. there's a scene to where Joe Wider actually goes into this guy's like magazine place. And like the guy like literally smokes after every single sentence. You overlooked and we, this thing is athlete's heart. <laughs> Kid, welcome to the big time. Ice! Um, thank you. Becky! Becky! Um, yes, but I, I'm gonna need a, a $5,000 advance and uh, a New Jersey office. Don't overkill it. What am I watching? Shelby actually, like, came in to watch, like, half, like, or not even half of it, like, yeah. maybe a tenth of it, and she goes, what was that? And I'm like, that was bigger than the movie, and she goes, that was shit. Yeah, that was trash. <laughs> so, um, so not a recommendation. Not a recommendation. You know, out of the other movies that we've talked about, that was definitely not a recommendation. There are many others that I would highly recommend. Twenty percent Rotten Tomatoes, folks. Spend your time just scrolling through the gym talks. Don't even worry about watching. Watch Generation Iron Three. Yeah. Watch. Uh, watch Any, anything else? As watch Ronnie Coleman the King if you want to be seriously depressed after. Yeah. Watch. Uh, Oh, that Netflix series that talks about um, Zane. I forgot his name, but he's like Zane the Great. Frank? I mean, no, 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 no. He, say he, 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 he was like, he's like. Oh, small. I know what you're talking he, about. Like, yeah, like, yeah, that's yeah, how he flexes. Yeah, 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 he yeah. could, he could like lift a tiger or something yeah, like that. Yeah, but, yeah, yeah. Um, yeah. So really, watch anything else other than that movie is from what I gather. And am I gonna check it out? Absolutely not. Cool. Not worth my time. Anyway. Anyway, thanks for tuning in, folks. Just a quick cool, cool, little short vid right here for you. Yeah. Appreciate you. What did you guys think about it? Uh, did you like it or change? Did you feel like there was something missing? Please put it in the comments down below. Make sure to like and subscribe, and thank you so much for watching.